tap factory, it's, uh, it means uh, the factory of tap dance. But I didn't want to create just a tap dance show. That's why I've bring, I brought lots of different kind of elements, like circus elements, dance, and urban percussion, to make it more, more fun and more diverse all, all around the show. Uh, the idea came something like three years ago, and the show has been really created two years ago. So we have been touring now for one year and a half, uh, lots of countries in Europe and uh, UK, France, Spain, Holland. We're going to go in USA uh, next month and uh, Switzerland also. Uh, I've been in the show for about half a year. The guys came to London uh, about a year and a half ago. Uh, so I saw the show there and I auditioned and then once once they had some more shows come up, I joined in November. Yeah, the audition was, we had to learn material quite quickly and then we had to improvise as well. But you know, it was, it was a nice audition. It wasn't a, a, a bad one like you sometimes get. So I've been dancing professionally for uh, nearly five years, mainly tap, but I used to do you know, ballet, jazz, contemporary, singing as well, but now I just tap. I'm the new guy, so this is actually my first tour with uh, Tap Factory. So we did one gig in Paris, and then this is my first tour with the, these guys. So we're going to do uh, Budapest in Switzerland, and then we go on to the USA. So I'm the new guy of the group. <laughs> a few musical theatre shows as well. We actually trained in the same college at different times where we trained in the same college in London. So um, that was interesting after we got talking to each other. But yeah, we do quite, quite a range of different jobs at the moment. I used to work with lots of different kind of artists, singer, comedian, uh, acrobats. And uh, the, I, have, I, have, I already had a, a passion for the the Charlie Chaplin humor and uh, this kind of really efficient thing that touched the, the, the audience directly but in a simple way. And this is the idea of the show. The, all the performances are really, really strong. Artists are really amazing. But the, the, the first thing in the show is that I wanted the audience to go out of the theater with just a big smile. The audience is really, really good ev everywhere. Lots of, lots of laugh, lots of standing ovation and, f and um, applause because I wanted to do a show really universal. There's no talking in the show, for example. It's really like uh, mute cinema. Tap Factory show is that obviously there's no language barrier. Uh, so that anyone can come and watch the show from any age to any language. I think everyone gets the show completely and can really get into it. Yeah, yeah, I completely agree. Yeah, uh, but yeah, the, the Hungarian audience has been really nice and they've been responsive. You know, they laugh when they're meant to laugh, they clap when they clap, <laughs> they, they seem to like the jokes and they like, they like the tap and the drumming. So. We had people from 5 to 92 years old and uh, everybody will really enjoy it and find something. The, the, the idea is that it won't be like strong percussion for two hours. We jump from one thing to another really fast so there's no time to get bored and it's just flowing. Yeah. 